Let's start first by creating the object present on the stage. So we'll go to File, New, and Air for Android Project. Click OK. Gonna grab my rectangle tool, make a blue fill and a black stroke. Okay, click V, double click, set the width to 480 and the height to 60 pixels. And then we'll align it to the stage, line horizontal and upper okay now we will convert this to a symbol by double clicking it and hitting f8 it's going to be of type movie clip click ok and give it an instance name of scoreboard double click and then we'll create a couple of text fields for the score itself Go to the text tool, first using the static text, set the size to 20, okay, well maybe 20 is too small, make it 30, okay that's better, layer, and CPU. Maybe maybe this this shade of blue is too dark. Let's change it to a lighter shade of blue. Okay, that's better. Okay, now to add a colon there. That should look better. Now we will create a couple of dynamic text, but we need to embed this font because dynamic text won't work unless you embed the font with it. So we'll use uppercase, lowercase, and or you know what? We'll only use numbers because we're not using upper or lower cases. This is going to be only scoring uh, numbers here, so we don't need any letters or characters, we only need numbers. Then click OK. I'm going to change the color to blue, to black, sorry. And we will create the text field. One here, and one here. And click the V. Click V. And just adjust the place placement of your text field. Maybe minimize it a little bit there. And this one as well. Okay. All seems good so far. Now let's create the players. Again, using our tri rectangle tool, make the fill yellow and make the stroke uh, I don't know, red. Is it red? Yes, it's red. You can make it, I think, better by making the edge a little rounder by five, maybe even more, 20, okay that looks, that looks better I believe, hit F8, convert it to a symbol, it's going to be a type movie clip and we'll register this at the center, call it uh, play pad. Click OK. Now let's copy this, paste, use one for the top. Maybe it's too big. Yeah, let's get inside it.
make it a little bit shorter. Yeah, that should do. Okay, now to create the ball, use the oval tool. And I believe I made the ball green. Okay, with no stroke. No stroke. V, double click, F8, convert it to a symbol, let's call it ball, register at the center, hit OK, and we'll name it ball. And we'll give this an instance name of player. We'll give this an instance name of CPU. Oops. Okay. This one will be named. CPU and this one we named CPU score and this one will be player score okay now to create the welcome screen that tells us which um, which method we want to play with touch screen or accelerometer. So again use the rectangle tool and I believe the color of this welcome screen is going to be ah, okay. It has a blue fill with a green stroke. Okay. Using the rectangle tool Make this a little smaller, about 15, that should be good. And then create a shape. And wrong colors. Blue background with green stroke. That looks good. Actually, I believe I've chosen the wrong shade of blue there. Ah, there we go. lighten the border a little bit. Okay. And we can make it a little bit bigger. maybe a little bit smaller, thinner, like that, yeah, that should be good. Now double click on it, hit F8, call it welcome screen, register at the center, type movie clip, click OK, now double click on it, get inside it, and here we will create the the buttons that tell us to play using the touch screen or the accelerometer. Those are movie clips, by the way. So we'll go back. Now to create the buttons, we simply use again the rectangle tool. Now we'll use a green fill and no stroke. V, double click, copy, paste, okay, here. Now we'll use some text, static text. Change the family font to the same one we've used above, which was, I believe, I believe it was this one. Font one, there we go. Make the color blue. We will say touch screen, and here it will say accelerometer. Okay. 
Okay. Just need to extend this a little bit, like this, and this one as well. Change the position of the text. Okay, those seem good. Now convert each one of these to a symbol into a button. This time, not a movie clip. That will be touch button F8. This one will be ACC button. Click OK. I don't know what happened there for a second. Click V, we need to minimize these <laughs> a little bit because they're too big. Okay, this one as well. Now here we need to add some text. Text is going to be black. I'm just going to say play with okay now let's convert this whole thing to a symbol F8 need to be type movie clip and we'll click OK This one should have been called Welcome Screen. Call this one Background. And we'll call this one Widget. Welcome Screen. Those are pretty much all the elements we're going to need for our game. 